<laughs> okay. You win. Oh, as usual. Yeah. Now we stretch. No, I don't want to. I hate that one. All right, come on. I know you hate it, but you're going to hate those calves hurting you even more. Fine. Fine, fine, fine. Come on. I'll do it. All right, let's take care of it. I promise. You are doing the right thing by giving this to me. Well, I had a good teacher. I've watched you, you know. I, I always put other people first. That's, that's a quality I've always admired. You won't be sorry. I will make sure that this ring never hurts another person again. Allison, just one thing. I really need to get going, Caleb. The ring is beautiful, isn't it? I will take really good care of it. I know you will. But are you sure that maybe you wouldn't rather have this one? Oh my god, you tricked me. Although yours is a, a pretty good fake. <laughs> but I assure you, this is the one you came for. Hey, Allison, you all right? What? Yeah, fine, fine. Uh, no, nah, nothing. You just seem a little distracted. Oh, I'm sorry. sorry. No, it's okay. You, you want to talk about it? No, no, it's really, uh, you know, it's nothing. I just have a lot of stuff on my mind. With the uh, club and the, you know, the lineup clothes. Yeah, yeah. I, j I just get worried, you know. Well, uh, well, don't. You know, it's just that, I don't know, it's just... Uh, Caleb in the ring and, yeah. and all that stuff, right? Yeah, you know, all of it. Yeah. Well, uh, oh, I gotta, I gotta get back to the gym. Got a kickboxing class in an hour. Are you ready? No, I do care if I just, if I just stay. The sun feels kind of good. No, that, that, that's cool. You stay. Uh, I, I really got to get back, though, so okay. I'll see you back at the gym. Right. Right. And wait, 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 do me a favor, will you? Please? Just, um, try not to worry about me so much, okay? Hey, <laughs> do I look worried? A little. Yeah, well, I am. But I'm trying, all right? See you at home. Okay. What a beautiful day. Well, it was. Caleb, why don't you get out of here? I don't want to see you, and I especially don't want to talk to you. Are you still angry? No, um, I don't really think the angry is the right word. Furious, disgusted, am I getting warm? More like really disappointed. No, not that, not, not disappointed. Say it isn't so. I can see that it means as much to you as I thought that it would. <laughs> Look, you, you came to me thinking you could sweet talk me out of my ring. You, you were wrong. What are you gonna do, sulk about it for the rest of your life? What would you like me to do? Do you want me to just forget about it? Is that it? Is that what you like me to do? Well, that would be a good start. No, I'm sorry. I can't do that. Look, you tried a con. It didn't work. You move on. Nothing's changed. You're wrong, Caleb. Everything has changed. Everything's changed? What? We're not friends anymore because I had a little fun with you. A little fun with me? Why don't you give me a break? I came to you with my heart on my sleeve, hoping to talk to you honestly. And you used it against me. You enjoyed being cruel to me. Yeah, well, you're enjoying this. Making it into some sort of tragedy because I hurt your little feelings, you know? Come on, you know how I am, all right? Snap out of it. Come on, toughen up a little. Why? So I can be more like you? No, no, thank you. Really. I don't want to go around hurting good people's feelings and not caring what they think or what they feel. You know, I thought maybe having spent a little time as a human being that they would have changed somehow maybe that you would have learned something you're wrong well now i know now you know but don't blame me because of what you thought allison no this mistake is yours not mine you saw what you wanted to see but i am who i am i don't pretend you need to feel safe so you create this whole illusion that I was like you. You know what, Caleb? 
You broke a promise to me. You promised that you would never hurt me. And I didn't. No, not physically. <laughs> Guilt trips don't work on me, Allison. Your definition of being hurt isn't even on my radar. I started to trust you. And I really thought that you started to trust me, too. What? Do, do you think I was just going to give you the ring because you asked for it? Well, I expected for you to at least hear me out. And whether or not you gave me the ring, well, that's a different story. But I never expected for you to treat me the way you did. Oh, go cry to your boyfriend. I wish that I could. I do. But I'm too embarrassed to tell him that I even went to go see you. He always told me Caleb should never be trusted. But I thought differently. So obviously he was right and I was wrong. I thought that you would have changed, but I can see that, that you won't. You know, I'd almost forgotten how comfortable humans are at playing the victim. It's what you do best. Right. Well, it's vampires like you that like to drain and torture people. That's what you do best. If you say so. Yeah, I do. And what if I were to say that you never gave a damn about me, ever? That everything you've ever told me was just one big lie? That our friendship meant absolutely nothing to you? Huh? That, that this whole thing was like one big game that I happened to fall into. You've never cared whether whether or not you've ever hurt my feelings or, or anything in regards to that, huh? W would that be safe to say, Caleb? I mean, is that really how you feel?